Welcome back everyone, I am The Executioner and today we're going to be talking about mining cryptocurrency. With Shiba Inu, Dogecoin, and Satama Inu, I wanted to talk about actually how you go about mining uh, these cryptocurrencies. There are various softwares out there like T-Rex Miner, Unminable, etc. that allow you to use a computer to mine these cryptocurrencies. However, you got to keep in mind that the newer the cryptocurrencies are, the better your old computer will be at mining it. The difficulty level will be far lower than, let's say, Bitcoin. If you tried to mine Bitcoin with a spare laptop, it would absolutely be fruitless. Number one, the mega hash rate is just a god awful. And two, you got to keep in mind uh, how long you want to mine for if you're using unminable for example there is going to be a payout so if you have hardware that's not necessarily good at mining let's say uh solar coin for example then that's going to be a bad thing because you're going to wait a very long time just to recoup what you put into it plus the electricity cost and the absolute god-awful uh, inefficiency of the machine itself now, if you're talking about Dogecoin, when it first came out, you could definitely mine uh, Dogecoin pretty efficiently on an old laptop. But the problem with it now is more people are mining, and the difficulty level has gone up to such a level that you really do need a good rig to mine Dogecoin effectively. While other coins like Doge Elon Mars, you could definitely mine that on a old computer when it first came out. But nowadays, even when you try experimenting, I've been experimenting with crypto mining, you need a graphics card just to get a satisfactory amount of Doge Elon for it to actually reach that payout level. Sometimes it's within 30 million Doge Elon coins. So what you really should do is find the newest coins available and mine those in hopes that they will go up in the future. Now, T-Rex Miner and all those other softwares are better because they don't have payouts to them. But the thing is, with Unminable, it allows you to mine cryptocurrencies that are basically, as it says in the name, unminable. Uh, Satama Inu, uh, Shiba, uh, Doge Elon Mars, etc. What it does is it will mine ETH hash. And what it will end up doing is the amount of ETH hash you would mine with Unminable will then be converted over to Doge Eloin, Shiba Inu, and Satama Inu. And this is a great criticism of cryptocurrencies in general. Could you mine Bitcoin on a laptop? You could, but it's not going to give you any great returns out of it. As somebody who's been doing cryptocurrency mining as a hobby... I can tell you that it is way more difficult than what some YouTubers will make it out to be. Uh, you can definitely do plug and play, that, that's a thing, but you're going to have to buy a rig for that, or buy an ASIC machine for that if you actually want to make it into a business. Now, you could definitely cobble together a crypto mining rig for less than at least $300 uh, if you have the graphics card on hand. But your budget here is probably going to be like $700 just to get all everything together. And even then, it's the graphics card prices are absolutely astronomical. So you're going to have to buy used graphics cards. So is it a venture worth pursuing? Yes, but you're going to have to wait a very long time to make your money back on it. Like any other business. Anyways, I hope you guys liked the video. Please subscribe, ring the bell, and have a wonderful weekend.